In this video, I'll be showing you guys a very simple forest scalping strategy. So for this strategy to work, you want to add this indicator, guys. This indicator is called EMA. It's called moving average exponential, guys. So you want to add that to your charts. So guys, you want to change the length from 9 to like 200. Let me see. Let me change this to be something bright. All right. So, so for this strategy to be a valid setup, you want to wait for price to like to be above the 200 EMA line. If you're looking for a sell, and if you're looking for a buy, you want to look for you're going to wait for price to be below the 200 EMA line. So you so you need to wait for a change in character of market structure. As you can see for this example, I'll be showing you guys. I'm using a sell trade because price was above the 200 EMA line, and you can see this strong break to the downside. And price crashed down breaking through that 200 EMA line so I saw this uh, this bullish candlestick came back to retest so you can see this bullish candlestick this um, one bullish candlestick came back to retest and then the price plummeted to the downside but not just plummeting to the downside price did something that really caught my attention and made me say yeah this is a valid setup so and there was something I, I, I call a change in character so but there was a change in character at this point. Uh, the first break below the 20 EMA line, the retest, that low, as right, you can see down here, there's a low you can see down here. That low is the break of market structure, the change in character. So, I'll be, uh, guys, I'm sorry because this is a pre recorded video. I made this video and my microphone wasn't working. So, I'm just going through the, the trade I took and, the, and breaking it down for you guys. So, I would pick out my my tool here and mark that zone. As you can see, I marked this zone out. I think I changed the color from black to white. So you can see there's a beautiful change in character at that point. You can see price broke below that lowest point price got to before the retracement back to that 200 EMA line. And you can see price came back to retest that 200 EMA line, but not uh, sorry to retest that change of character black line I added at that point. But price didn't just retest it. There is something I called a supply demand zone. If you can see, there's a strong supply to the downside. This yellow golden candlestick you can see at this point is my indicator that is an in indicator I like to add to help me spot supply and demand in the market. So you can see there's this beautiful um, sell side liquidity, um, sell side momentum to the downside, which is this sell side supply. And I marked that zone out and as you can see, price came back to retest that supply zone. You can see price clearly came back to retest that supply zone. Alright guys, so I would usually suggest you use like 1% risk on trades like this and please make sure to back test the strategy and be sure you enjoy or you like and you trust this strategy. As you can see at this point, I got in on this trade and my stop loss was slightly above that supply zone, slightly above that supply zone. And my take profits would obviously be like a 1 to 2 or a 1 to 1 1.5. I usually recommend my students on the VIP group and on my mentorship to always go for a 1 to 1.5 minimum or at least a 1 to 2 is my sweet spot when I take my profits. So you can clearly see price fair. Like you can look, look at this strong candlestick, this strong momentum to the downside. This clearly indicates that this is a good setup for me because you can see there's a change in character at this point. This white line indicates my change in character of market structure after the retest. All right, guys, wait for the breakout and the retest. Your supply demand zone must be after, like you should consider taking the supply demand zone after the breakout of that um, lowest point price got to before the retracement, which is an indication of change in character, which means price wants to continue going down. All right. So, so that's all for today's video. If you found value in this video, please make sure to drop me a like, subscribe and share this video with your friends. Drop me a comment if there's something I said that you didn't fully understand and I'll make sure i reply to your comments and if you want to join the vip signal group i send out signals every single day then dm me on instagram because it's a closed private vip group 